What is up, man? NFL 25 Gamers. Welcome to our play of the day series. And in today's video, we're going to be breaking down the Dime Flat Zone Blitz. Uh, what I like to do with the Dime Flat Zone Blitz is I like to base the line. I like to quarterback spy my left of screen defensive tackle. I like to contain my right of screen defensive tackle. And then I can contain this left of screen defensive end. I can put him into a deep blue zone or I could man him up on the slot. And you should see that I get right edge pressure uh, at the quarterback. And there you see the right edge pressure come in. Now, another thing that I've been working on with this play here is, uh, oh, and then really quick, I also want to show you the flip version of this setup. So you just want to hit square or X on Xbox, three, Xbox One. You want to hit R2 to flip the play. You're going to, again, base a line. You're going to quarterback spy the right of screen defensive tackle now. Quarterback contain the left of screen defensive tackle. And then you're going to drop... This guy right here, the right of screen defensive end in a man assignment or into a zone. And you're going to see we should get that left edge pressure once again from the back, from the D-back. So uh, that's what we like to do with this play. Now, one way we can get um, – one interesting thing about this is we can man align. And did you see that they're going to inch a little bit closer? Um, so if we man align and press, you see how they're going to get a little bit closer to the line of scrimmage? And I've been working on this because it might give us a little bit better pressure. So let's see, the same setup, just man aligned and pressed, brings the same pressure. And you see it, it, ultimately it does. Now what you can do from there is try to create the same alignment with the line of scrimmage. You see we can spread the line out. Now we're going to try to crash the line, contain both the tackles, and then potentially blitz Brock off that edge. And let's see if we can get two guys free. And you see we do. So that's just a little method there that you can lab. Uh, send six, get two free out of the dime flat. Um, again, this is just something uh, that I wanted you guys to kind of take a look at. But again, next gen Madden, obviously it's not going to work two times in a row because that would be ridiculous. But it is something that you can use. So there's a six man blitz. There's a five, three man blitz. Now what about a two man blitz? Been working on this. Let's see if it works here. So we're going to quarterback spy this guy here, Dorsey. We're going to then drop Williams into a flat zone, um, or we can drop him in a man assignment. But I like to drop him into a flat zone. And then we're going to drop Smith into that man assignment. Let's see if we can get two-man pressure. And you see we get that pressure in at the quarterback. It is a little bit longer, but it is effective. And I really, really like this play zone blitz from the dime flat. Uh, very powerful play because you can send it from both sides. And um, another thing is, and there you see we got picked up that time, but man and zone. So if you audible down, you get the one-man DB strike. This is essentially the same play, but it's from a man formation. So we're going to, this time, we're going to quarterback spy Dorsey. We're going to do that, and then we're going to drop. Basically, this is the same setup as zone blitz, uh, minus just to the dropping of the zones. And you see, we don't get the same pressure, uh, but we do get some. And uh, that's all I wanted to show you. So uh, I just wanted to kind of get you guys thinking about the dime flat this year. Uh, in my opinion, it's one of the better uh, defenses uh, just to kind of pick up and use. And uh, it has some really good stock plays. So there you see we get that man version and zone version. So a lot more to come from the dime flat, something I'm working on. It's really nice because you got the corners backed off and you have that kind of a kind of a quarter look at the backside. So uh, a lot of good stuff from the dime flat, but add this to your playbook. If you have any questions about it, let me know and we'll talk about it in the comments below. Thanks for your time.